Hi guys, it's Sophie. So I'm going to be doing a review video today and it's a little bit behind. I should have reviewed it when I first read it, but I didn't get around to it quick enough. Um, and it is for You Know You Want This um, by Kirsten Rupenian. Um, and she is the lady who wrote Cat Person, which lots and lots of people have read. It is a really good, like, long form um, fiction piece, like short story um, about a woman who goes on a date with this guy and doesn't really like him but there's this like feeling of obliged to do things with him um, and if you haven't read it do do check it out I think it was a New Yorker one so um, you can look it up online anyway um, and she has actually written short stories and been published in a number of different places before Cat Person um, but this is the first one that sort of came out as a, as a full collection of short stories from her. Um, I actually received this one um, for review um, but I'm going to be giving away this copy because Acacia really kindly bought it for me for my birthday as well so I ended up with two copies um, so I'm going to pass one on because I really enjoyed the book and I really think you guys will enjoy it too. It's quite hard to describe like individually these short stories because I think whilst they're all fairly realistic in terms of setting and in terms of some of the events each one of them has a kind of unbelievable air to it um, with one exception there's one in here which i think is called um i think it's, it's, it's the items that's made up hang on the mirror the bucket and the old thigh bone which i think is just completely different to the other ones um but so for example um one of the later stories in the book is about a girl who, when she's a very young child, has an issue with biting people and we see her as she grows up having in this kind of urge inside her to be biting everyone that she's coming up to and she's just learned it's not right but she's not ever felt like she doesn't want to do it. Um, another um, one would be Sardines which is a story about a collection of children who play sardines with a woman they don't really like with some horrible consequences. Um, so they, they have kind of this realism feel to them the whole way through all of the stories, um, but there's often like a little tweak to them. Um, the one I mentioned which is different is almost like it could be true but it feels more like it's almost like fantasy-esque. Um, just the way that it's told. So yeah, it's, it isn't necessarily what I was expecting from her. I thought we were going to be looking at like really realistic shots of relationships and I think a lot of this book does relate to relationships or about love being um, somehow kind of broken or not used in the right way. So I did really like a lot of these short stories um, and I think I actually quite enjoyed the collection for what it was. It reminds me a lot of other short story collections that I've really enjoyed. Um, I can't remember what was the author called again, Carmen Maria Machado. Um, I really liked her short stories and it reminded me a little bit of that like Mouthful of Birds vibe that I read earlier on this year. Um, and I, I, yeah, I think I'm really glad that I've read it and I'm really glad that I've read wider than Cat Person because whilst I understand like how important Cat Person was for a lot of people to read and to see themselves in, um, I do think she's wider than that and I think there's a bit of a risk that we only view her as the person who wrote that one short story. Um, so as I say, I'll be giving away this copy because um, I already have a beautiful copy. Um, of my own. So if you are interested um, please leave a comment down below saying that you would like to be entered. Um, I'll open it from today and I'll, I'll probably leave it open for a week after the video is published and then I collect all the comments together and I randomise a number and whoever is my random winner I will um, reply to your comment and say that you've won and we can chat about how to send it to you from there. Uh, it is international and um, I get asked that quite a lot in the comments and I always forget to say it so it is an international giveaway um, I will send it anywhere that I kind of can send it to you so don't worry about that if you want to enter an international put your details down below too. So hopefully that's been helpful and enjoyable and yeah do put your comment down below if you're interested in winning a copy. Um, I'll see you guys again really soon in my next video and look after yourselves until then. Bye.